everyone is seeking any kind of relief from the heat. And many are at Millennium Park's Crown Fountain, including our own Mai Martinez, who also took a look at those who had to work in these difficult conditions. Jim, on a hot day like today, any bit of cool off is a great relief. Perhaps that's why there's so many people splashing around in the fountain behind me. Unfortunately, not everyone has the luxury of taking a break from the heat, like Jason Heller. Hi, this is Jason from Mr. Duck Heating and Air Conditioning. Yeah, come on up. Heller's a welcome sight for heat-weary homeowners like Matthew McCammon, whose air condition went on the fritz last night. It went to 85 degrees in a heartbeat. First thing I want to check is a clean blower motor. And I think that's the problem. You have a bad blower motor, sir. Knowing the problem was fixable was music to McCammon's ears. It's like 93 degrees and maybe raining today. It's going to be pretty swampy. So without air conditioning, you suffer. And Heller says he's not alone. How many calls have you been on today? Oh, but too many to count. It's been, it's been, the phones have not stopped. What do some of the homeowners say to you after they feel that first breeze of cold air start coming back out? Thank you. I love you. <laughs> a lot of love for you. Yes, absolutely. Are you kind of like a summer superhero? I would say so. Yeah, sure. <laughs> and with it being so hot, it's a good time to remind people that they can call 311 to find the nearest cooling center in the city. Jim, as for that homeowner in our story, we're happy to report that his air conditioning is working again. So I'm sure he's enjoying a bit of a cool down now. Probably not as much as the folks behind me.